people call me a witch. <laughs> Why? Well, what is it that I'm actually doing? I think it's not so easy to explain. I've always been drawn to the magical, mystical things and also topics about healing and how healing happens. Well, I have a very deep connection to nature and to the spirits of nature, also to animals and plants. Well, I don't necessarily call myself a witch, but I think we are all witches, especially the women who have this very deep, deep, deep understanding of being connected to Mother Earth and this inner voice they have. We say that it's located in the area of your womb. And this makes us see things with different eyes, not with our physical eyes. And there are so many realms, other realms that the reality we live in. The thing that, I, that makes the tipi so special for me is it's like a sacred place. It's protected, but still it's, it's white and it's very friendly inside. And I can make a fire there. And the fire is a very, very important element for my work because it's got the power of transformation. I see my mission in helping people to restore themselves, to heal themselves, to help them heal themselves. And one of the tools I have or I use is a very soft touching of the body and listening what the body is trying to tell me or trying to show me. Everybody has these healing powers inside of him or herself. I am actually not doing the healing. I'm just pushing it a little bit and the, the body will do itself. Dancing, it's about connecting with the earth. And um, what's so special about it is that we wear long skirts, nothing underneath, so no underwear, and we are barefoot on the ground, and then we move to the music just the way we feel. Even though if it's maybe looking ridiculous or maybe strange, or if we maybe are lying all down on the floor or whatever, so it's about an intuitive move, moving to music. So I wouldn't actually call it dancing. The drum makes me instantly very, very calm. So I have this very special rhythm I'm, I'm drumming. It's pretty fast. That makes my brain go in a, in, a, in, a, in a special state of mind, like a little bit like in a trance. It also helps me to make contact with my, um, my guiding um, spirits like my power animals or certain plants I'm working with. I'm not afraid of following my heart. I'm not afraid to listen to this inner voice. I'm not afraid of other people telling me that I might be crazy because I talk to trees or I hug trees or I go outside to um, to connect myself with Mother Earth. So you can dance, you can just dance, or you can dance. 
You can have a connection or you can have a connection. So both is okay, but it's always possible to go a little bit deeper and a little bit deeper and a little bit deeper. But it takes some courage also. But because you never know what maybe is going to dig up if you go deep. I am not the healer and I am not the witch. I'm here to help the women to discover their own healing powers and their own, their own witch, witchiness, or however you say that. Yeah.